As previously noted, I've ran into a no spark condition with this new high performance distributor by Davis Unified Ignition. So I went six ways to Sunday with this thing and I'm finally on Sunday. I've replaced the ignition coil wondering if that was wrong. Well, now we can pretty much rule that out that that was not the problem. I got into dis to uh, diagnosing the coil. The coil diagnosed perfect, with no problems at all. So I checked it against the ground and there was no ground. And here's what we're dealing with. This is the grounding wire right here. That grounding wire connects right here to this to this painted magnetic core. There is no connection between this ground <laughs> and this and this the core for this for this um, coil. Additionally, this is the ground cable that goes in the center position of the distributor cap, which grounds the whole distributor internally. That connects right here. You can see the scar from this little guy connected right there. Absolutely no ground connection from here to here, which goes, which grounds the ignition module inside. So the distributor itself grinds, grounds from the motor itself, the, the housing and the distributor. We're going to clean that up and see if we get a start now. Another workmanship and materials malfunction showed up here too. This is the ground lug right here for the distributor. Okay, this grounds the coil. Whoever did the heat shrink on this wire also took it halfway across the terminal. So that's additionally causing a problem with this distributor's coil finding ground. Unbelievable. So after all this monkeying around, we got everything back in. Got the grounds all straightened out on the internal portion of the distributor. So I haven't started this thing up in several weeks, probably three. Let's see what happens. I don't have a choke, the camp's too big. 